Here's another double integral. Um, again, this integral is uh, fairly straightforward. Uh, however, um, this integral must be done as an iterated integral. The integrand is not a product of a function of x and a function of y, so this won't separate out in a nice way. Um, however, we can just integrate with respect to y and then with respect to x, and we can evaluate this integral. The region of integration is very simple. The y limits are 0 to 1, and the x limits are 0 to 1. So we have a square. Integrating with respect to y first, as that's the order in which our uh, integral is written, gives Note that x is constant with respect to y when we integrate. So that just looks like a constant, pretend it's 3, it picks up a y uh, and lives there, 0 to 1. We now have to evaluate this integrand at, at the two limits. Let's do this very slowly. The upper limit gives. 1x plus 1 squared over 2 minus uh, 0x plus 0 over 2. Right, so obviously that's 0. So what we end up with, the integral from 0 to 1 of x plus a half dx which is equal to x squared on 2 plus a half x between 0 and 1. The bottom limit is obviously 0 again. Uh, however, the top limit yields a value of, of, of 1 because we get a half plus a half, and that's equal to 1. All right. 